Good morning everybody, it's Denise here, Denise Junk Journals UK. Thank you so much for joining me, it is lovely to have you here. And I am working on the, um, or finishing off, because it needs to go in Etsy today, the, um, uh, yes, 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 what is it? It's a design team project for Tina at Shabby Dabby Doo Da, and it's um, spring and Easter themed, so... Yeah, it needs to be needs to be on today, doesn't it? So I'm not going to um, overly fill it. It's quite heavy actually already. I think it's probably the um, the cover is quite chunky, even though it's a soft fabric one. Um, but I did want to just say um, I put three of these on Etsy yesterday, and um, I wasn't sure, but I suspected they would all go because I've got the 25% off um, sale on, and. Um, I think it made them seven pounds something so you know a silly silly well an affordable price shall we say a pocket money price um and i think i told you i still had one on my desk not finished so i thought you know seeing as people are wanting them i'll i'll finish this one off and it's something cleared off my desk <laughs> so i've done it i've finished it it's exactly the same except for it's i think it's got one page less or so that'll be four sides one of these um i found sitting on my desk and i think it should have been in here so other than that it's you know it's the same same as all the others that I did the, the flip through um, or the Etsy share on camera only yesterday. Yeah, it was only yesterday. They all sold the day I put them up. So um, I've popped this one in. So, you know, if you're quick and you're in the UK, um, you can grab that for £7 something. Postage paid. And, um, you know, it's there now. So this, this video hasn't even started to load. So it might be gone, might be gone when you go and look. But if not... <laughs> That's the last one. Um, yeah, so this this lovely journal. Uh, loving, absolutely loving this um, embroidery on here. Couldn't decide whether to, you know, put a topper on top of that. But it would be a shame, wouldn't it, to hide it? So, yeah, I'm, I'm leaving that. I've just put some lovely pink. They are modern little beads, but um, cute pink and sort of an ivory colour just to finish that off. Um, and I've just brought a few bits. Let's just remind ourselves of the pages. So there are quite a few beautiful pages. I stitched them. Um, so this one is from Tina's Easter kit. This is from her, I think it's faded blue and green lace backgrounds. Um, I believe I've put all the description, uh, the links in the description, but I'll double check. That's graphic 45 paper. Again, this is the Easter kit, the one that was 32 pages. You know, brilliant um, value for money. And I've put, yeah, I've stitched them all together with a plain, plain on the back because these are, you know, beautiful but full on. Um, I've put some pieces of lace here and there. Um, yeah, just beautiful colours and beautiful images. So the pages are quite thick. They're, they're sort of card-ish. What did I put in the middle? Oh yeah, two, two envelopes stuck together because I was going to come on and do this when I was poorly. So I'm, you know, I'm behind with it. So I was, I was hoping to have it filled in two videos and then put on, but I think it's, it's, we've got a week to Easter. So I know Easter's a fortnight long, but so I want to get it finished and on. So yeah, some beautiful images, but lots and lots of, um, you know, plain pages to be journaled on as well. So what have I brought with me now? I told you that um, Violet sent me some. Uh, Violet is one of my subscribers and a friend <laughs> who um, I call the die cut queen. I'm sure you've heard me talk about it before. She sends me lots of lovely die cuts. And um, yeah, I told you I got some happy mail from her. Was it yesterday or the day, day before yesterday? Anyway, when I was poorly. Maybe the day before that. And I haven't had a chance to share it with you yet, but I have been in having a little dib dabble. And I thought some of these, a couple of these would be nice in here. So this is a lovely pocket. And um, but yeah, it's a die cut pocket. And then she's she's got a die cut, um, what would you call that? A die cut, <laughs> a circle, circular die cut. And she's put it through a hole in the in the pocket with with some string and then she's just put you maybe can't see that just a, a plain piece of card on the back it's really clever a really clever way to um attach a, a dangle that's what it is it's a die cut dangle uh you know and it's not going to hinder the pocket at all absolutely love the papers 
and then this one is a few little envelopes um she does put them on her etsy i think the other day i said um no i said etsy ebay store i said etsy but i will put her down in the description as well um but i love this one because it's got it's got glitter i don't know if you're picking that up it's beautiful i know you've seen these little envelopes before they're gorgeous and um, so i thought that might make a nice tuck so i've got a pocket in the tuck like i say i'm not going to put a lot in it i pulled out of my stash this has been in here a long long time so this is edith holden page a very old one um that i cut into a, a file folder shape never done anything with i think that needs to go in here just love the colors um and then or possibly go in here one of my book page makes and this was the um double gusseted pocket or double gusseted envelope um and it, this is out of the lakes book it's like fabric that so i thought that might be nice in it um what else have i got all these that i did on a uh, covered on a was it a scrappy sunday sorting out the box so i thought obviously they're not all going to go in but a couple of them can be tucks and a couple of them can be tags i've got a full pile of those there um layered tag dangles i did one uh, scrappy saturday sunday i think and put this beautiful beautiful dragonfly on there i love that one as well thought that might not might go nice in here i brought one of my what were these uh postage stamp clusters layered clusters that was the other day um i've just got a few bits from my graphic 45 papers that are sitting around on my desk i've got a big blob of glue on it off you go i've got this picture that's been sitting around for a while digitalis what is it you know what it's called Fox foxglove i've got a wills original cigarette card uh, a butterfly and a bird in a circle a label some more little fussy cuts, a couple of Tim Holtz flowers, and um, what have we got here? A couple of paper clips, altered paper clips, a little bit of bling, just all sorts of bits off my desk. Anyway, <laughs> so I guess the first thing I want to know is what am I going to put in the front and the back pockets? And I don't know if I've brought anything along that I want to, unless I want to put that in there. No. Um, I did have an envelope, didn't I? Yes, here it is. Look, one of these lovely pink envelopes. So that would be a good idea to put in there. Um, I'm just wondering about my little, where's my little stamp cluster that I had? Yeah. Shall we pop that on it? Let's do it. Okay, let's get this glue out. Oops. And see if it wants to play today on things like this because it's not going to it's not going to spread or anything is it and i've just seen this token of love i think that might be a tim holtz wouldn't that be lovely on the back let's do that and then what i'll do is i'll put some um, papers out of my scrap box and pretty papers inside it um, to play in the journal but it is going up today and the um the 25% sale is on for, I think, another five days yet. Just looking if I want something on here, label-wise. Um, yeah, another five days, so that would probably be the time to buy it. Don't want anything grungy. I want nice, clean, not too big. Oh, well, that's nice. They're all very big. No, I'll leave you out, though. You're pretty. Let's go with you. I just, as you know... I like to have something on that front page. Right, I'm going to use the art glitter for this one. You know, where you can make it your own with a title or a word or... Yeah, that's pretty. Lovely. I love the colour. It goes perfectly. Okay, so we're off. Now, one of these wants a tuck on. Which one shall we go with? Although, no. I can save that a bit. Um... Let's have one of these as a tuck. That green would go nice on there, wouldn't it? We're still keeping it pretty plain. Or we could go floral. 
Well, that brings the pink in from across there, doesn't it? There's another one. Yeah, I like that one better. Okay, I think it needs ink in around the edge. I'm not going to go heavy with the ink, but sometimes, sometimes it just needs a little bit of, uh, what do you say when you make it stand out? A bit of a border. I haven't asked you how you are. I hope you're all well. I hope you're all looking forward to, right, which side do I want it to tuck in that way, I think. Yeah, which means don't put the glue where my thumb is. <laughs> Looking forward to the bank holidays that are coming up. Um, well, that is us in the UK. I don't know if everybody has bank holidays for you know Easter time. Now I know Easter is a a Christian festival. I'm not sure if they have it in other religions. Not very knowledgeable on these things so what am I going to put in it I feel like it wants something you know because it's very full on isn't it it wants something quite big it wants a nice big tag don't have anything sitting there what have I got here I've not got a lot in hand reach I think these are things that are not finished let me just have a look under here I don't want to spend forever looking for something, but, you know, I was going to tidy this out. I don't suppose you can even see it. <laughs> it's got a lot of ephemera in it. So I'm going to have to just put it on my knee and have a look through, I think. A lot of it is... Um, yeah, quite old. <laughs> it keeps getting pushed to the back, so maybe this would be a good time to dig some out and um, a lot of it is pockets as well so what have we got going on oops that's quite nice let me put that on the floor before it falls on the floor oh it's quite thick that though Def definitely too thick um i don't like the yellow of that i don't suppose that wants to go does it I feel like it wants something a bit plainer, a bit book pagey. Let's see what book page I could pop in it. Oh, yes. Who's this? Miss Victoria Plum. Oh, an Easter chick, do you think? Let's go with that one. <laughs> so, yes, yeah, she probably could do with, if you want to journal on her, being covered with paper or been gessoed on but you might just want to read the actual story or the page have we got her there we have i think that was more luck than judgment <laughs> cute okay and then i think a label on there oh she's just that's it let's not hide her face what did we think to that pink label too much? Another plain one. The plain labels are going to come into their own today, I think, aren't they? A bit lighter than that. Yeah, it might end up being a longish video, this, that's all. Take me a while to get it up to you. Um, they're both the same, aren't they? Oh, that one. Yeah, I said lighter and it's not, but... Yeah, it might take a while to get to you, but yesterday's, um, I did say you might get two yesterday. One took all day to load. It was only 40. I think it was just 40 minutes, wasn't it? And it took hours and hours, so, so we'll see. I think it might like a butterfly on it as well. You see, I've started. Where are they? Excuse my arm. It would help if I put everything back where I got it from when I get it out. I don't. <laughs> I have a few out on my desk and then I shuffle them. Just put them away wherever. Nice big blue on there. It's just another colour you're bringing in though, Denise. That's a Tim Holtz one. That's nice. It, it goes with the tag, doesn't it? I wonder if it'd be nice on the tag. No, I like it up there. Okay. Okay. 
and I'm wondering about this label up here. That would be nice. Just so that that page has got a, a focus. I don't know. Might end up with some more lace on it yet. Yeah, I don't know. Like I say, I'm trying not to overdo it. I'll just put that page in there just to make sure we're not sticking together. Um, I'm just going to try this on every one till I like it on there as well, but until I find the one for it. Um, there's a tuck, do we think? I've got that, which I think would make a nice pocket. Just see if I've got a tag I would like in it. Well, that's the same kind of stuff, isn't it? Yeah, what do we think? Yeah, like it. So it's graphic 45, that one. Not going to ink it. It's nice and strong, but it's nice and light, which is good for a, a thick, heavy journal. And then I'll be able to show you the bride one that I'm in the middle of making. Okay, so we're going to have you that way with the blue showing. So what are we going to have on it? Oops. Where did you come from, little bird? You look like you've been pulled off something, don't you? What have you been pulled off? Because I like you. You've got a bit of glue, glitter glue behind you. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use him because I don't know what he's come off. I don't know if he's fallen off something. No, I think I might have to fabric tack it just because it's got a bit of, a little bit of g glitter glue. <laughs> or gitter glue, if you like. And then I'll take the tag out, I think, and let it dry. Not in there. He's a little cutie. You are a little cutie. I think I might want a little label on the back though. Well, look at that one. It's not very... I think it's meant to be an oval. It's... <laughs> hmm. Yes, yeah, so if that's an oval. I'm an excellent singer. <laughs> oh, those that will know me will know what a laugh that is. Couldn't carry a tune in a bucket, isn't that what they say? Yeah. Absolutely, both me and my sister. In fact, my sister's worse, if that's possible. Completely tuneless when it comes to singing. Don't know, don't know what we didn't get, but <laughs> gosh. There we go, little little guy. Um, yeah, I'm just going to leave that. I think these these squares are going to be gorgeous for writing in. Am I off camera? For journaling in. So I'm just going to leave that entirely. This wants something and I'm, I'm in love with these little things for tags, so I think I'm going to go with you. The For tucks, these little tags for tucks. It used to be my go-to thing at once, once upon a time. I seem to be going back there again. you go in there. I know you're bright, but we are very, we're bright. Let's not pretend we're not. <laughs> we are bright. So, do we want a little butterfly up there? Yes. Oh, this is decisive. Shush, don't say that or I'll stop. <laughs> It'll all come crumbling down. Yeah, so that's a lovely, you know, journaling spot again. And I think, again, we'll go with a, a plain label on that. Oh, that's a nice one. It's very plain. It's got a very thin border around it. And the tuck. Whoops. Cute. You need to be dry now, so we'll have you in there. I'm not going to do anything with these pages. They're just... I do hope the camera is doing the colour justice. I said last time, you know, sugar diamonds and... Yeah, the colours are beautiful. 
um, just saw that here and I thought that would go nice opposite this page up or down oh, I like it there so this is a Tim Holtz um, they're called floral cutouts I think they're called botanical but actually I think they're all florals embellishments not cutouts just thought the colour went really well yeah that kind of frames whatever's going to be journaled or created on there yeah I tended to put something at the bottom but I really shouldn't so I won't let's get another book page to pop in there oh hello crying ladies <laughs> so it's fun having the one beautiful page and the one page to decorate I'm loving these with them as well these um, graphic 45 little cutaway tickets is that the one that I put better not put the same one in no nope, it's not but I, it's very similar I want something different oh look I'm not going with it though. Um, I've got quite a few of them. Did I show you that as well? That's from one of Tanya's. Um, <laughs> where's my scissors gone? Oh, they're, they're away on the hook. Uh, digitals in it. She's got a full set of them. Uh, Etsy. Thought it would be a nice pocket filler. might be nice somewhere but no still got this green oh let's try the i've tried the butterfly for a while have we no i don't like it with that dark pink uh, background this is quite a thick no too thick i suppose i could cut the gusset off it though it's on really thick card so the gusset is making it no <laughs> no not with this I think it might have to be, oh, that's nice, I was going to say uh, one of these, one of these smaller ones. Should I do an up tuck? What does that say? Write it on your heart that every day is the best day in the year. Somebody David, somebody Henry David, somebody it looks like. Um, yeah, I'm going to put it on like a belly band, but as an uptuck. <laughs> Does that make sense? It will when I put it down. <laughs> so I'm just not gluing the top, but it's it's going to be an uptuck. So if you want to shove something all the way through, you can shove it all the way through is not a very nice way to explain it to me but you're probably too thick are you to show you oh, lots of those pretty flowers haven't i got anything thin that i can no you don't yes i do you know if you want it to go right up there it can be what am i going to tuck in it I don't quite like that, but I've got this like cartoony, um, you know, rabbits here, so I'm not sure anything like that will go. Let me have another look. We're not violet, sent me. I've not not got them out and had a look yet. <laughs> I just keep seeing things through the wrapper and thinking, oh, that's nice. What have got here? This is interesting. Do spoil me violet aren't they gorgeous that goes nice with that as well i don't want it in there though all that right no more digging in the papers denise um so what are you going to tuck up there i mean i've got just some plain ones that i could put something on let's see the plain ones that i mean i quite like that stripe green stripey one as you know well, it's just got some florals there, probably better, aren't they? Mm -hmm. 
I'm going to leave that one for now and come back to it. Might be that I want some of the, you know, the kit pages folded up and put, oh, maybe some of the lace pages. Have I got them anywhere near? No, <laughs> I haven't. Okay, so this one's got the lace on it and we've got blue. No. Oh, now. Now, if I didn't have that on there, I would really like that. So I'm going to look at the back and see. I've got it on both grey pieces. Did I only have one grey piece in? No, I didn't. But I'm not sure if I like it against that now. Where's the other grey piece? Oh, it's better against... Oh, I don't know. No, I like it against that one. I just like this blue butterfly against this. Um, I'm thinking if I put some lace across the bottom. You know, once it's on, add some blue, blue lace across the bottom. Oh, that's pretty. That's quite thick. That's not really what I want. This is the vintage stuff. I keep finding more and more of. Mm, no. Let's check one more, but I don't think it's. That's the one I've already tried. Oh, you're quite pretty as well. You look like a, a vintage piece. You are. I've obviously tied it up. Hmm. Yeah, I think that might go on there. It just ties the lace with the lace and the blues with the blues. Um, lovely. How long have I been? Oh, goodness me. I'm not even halfway through it yet. Although I wasn't supposed to be putting something on every page. Are you just being awkward now? You don't feel like you're coming out much. I mean, it is coming out, but I'm having to squeeze it hard. And it's not a great deal coming out. It's going to be dry by the time I stick it on. Right, so a little bit higher, I think. Yeah, I think some of these pockets and tucks I'm going to fill with some of the... Do you remember the faded blue and green lace page that I showed you? There'll be another one coming up. I think that was a huge kit as well. I've got a lot of pages of that. And they'll make lovely pocket fillers in here. Do I want it past or just on? I think it's just the right size and the right shade of blue. Do we like it? I'm still not convinced. No, I don't like it on there, so I'm not going to put it on. I didn't have anything that went in there, did I? Um, I did dig this out though. Look, this can make a nice belly band on the another page. Do I want something on every page though? Maybe further back then. The blue page further back. Where are you there? Look, that's one of the lace, you know, blue and green lace faded pages that I'm talking about. Yeah, love that. Okay. And I'm not going to fill everything, so I don't think I will put anything in. That wasn't a very good measure, was it? I don't think I'll put anything in this belly band because it's going to look beautiful. And like I say, I don't want to overfill the, the book and... It will leave something for the new owner to play with. Gorgeous piece of lace, this. Or trim, whatever you would call it. Let's get that on down. Yeah, lovely. It's a bit um, shorter now than I wanted, but 
I'd rather it too short than too long. Okay, that is going to take a little bit of drying, so um, if I can put my, that's it, that should hold that there, right, where did I get to? Can you actually see what's happening though? That's, that's the problem. Let's lift you up a little bit. You're getting darker, aren't you? Okay, so probably a piece of paper in there um, and possibly in there. And then I want to leave a page or two, so let's just decorate. Let's get rid of that lace because I can't see anything for it. And let's put the pin in here. It might just, might just help it. looking at that birdie there that would be lovely on there wouldn't it just taking away the journal in though aren't I um where are all my little bits and pieces this lovely Tim Holtz flower that would be nice I've got a lovely blue butterfly and I've got a nice label these oh, they're lovely these will be from Tanya love that one might be nice on a pink page I quite like this on here I'd like a label behind it though so let's go for a plain let's go for a plainer one not quite that big I don't know if you can see me labels or not from hmm, it's not quite want something a bit longer for this to sit on no definitely need a long one so do I want long plain no I don't think I do I want something on it specimen too big this one no. Nope. Yep, just fast me forward, those of you that are getting impatient. <laughs> I know some people love to watch it and some don't. I said not plain, but I like that. What do you believe? Oh no. Just flung off somewhere. Hang on. Eee, dear. Jet propelled. Ow. Oops, my legs are starting to hurt now, so that might be a cue to stop and come back at her in a little while. I've been sat here quite a while, actually. If I put that lower than I wanted it, I don't mind it there. Make sure I want that and not that. Okay. Can you still see what I'm doing? I know I've moved the camera. I'm going to turn it off though and go put my leg up for a half an hour or so because it's just starting to niggle me and I don't, don't want to make it poorly again. I'll have that down on there. I wonder if I should upload what I've done so far. That would be a good idea, wouldn't it? Yeah, I think it probably would, just in case my leg gets worse. And then, yeah, do another one. Do the other half an hour and I'll come back with some of those papers that I want as well, so that'll make life easier. I think I might want a bit off there. I think that... Oh, I've got my page, Denise. That might be offending me, I don't know. <laughs> Bang, bang, bang. Yeah, I'll come back and um, fill some of the pages and things with you because I'm not going to do a flip through of this one. I'll just show you it at the end and and it will be it'll be up on Etsy if it isn't already. 
by the time you see this. No, it can't be, can it? Because I won't have it finished. Silly. Yeah, okay, so I will be back later on with another 25 minutes or so. Um, continue filling it so you'll see it finished very, very soon. Thank you for watching so far and um, have a lovely what's left of the day. Bye for now.